In just under a week, the Pulaski School Board will have a new member. I'm your Pulaski neighborhood reporter, Perry Apostolakos, and I caught up with the candidates about their campaigns. The February primary narrowed the field to two candidates, Steve Legal and Jenny Rabicki. Legal took the most votes in that contest, 960 to Rabicki's 596. Now they're going head to head in next week's election for the school board member at large seat. Legal says two of the most important issues facing the district are safety and financial transparency. How are students treating each other? How are they treating our staff? How are we managing the ins and outs of our buildings within the district? How do we get the, the, you know, the taxpayers more involved in the budget process as well as the spending process? Rabicki says throughout her campaign, she's been speaking with voters about teacher retention. It seems like with, we're within the state average based on the data, um, but I've, I've said it before that sometimes you've got to dive deeper into the data if it keeps coming up as an issue. I also asked the candidates, how will you address these issues if you're elected? My recommendations to the board immediately would be getting more law enforcement involved in our school district, you know, and with the planning of our safety of our students, law enforcement knows best. I think really initially just getting my feet wet and understanding all the things going on in the district. We are a seven school district. The opportunity to just get, get my feet wet, start to really understand where, where the issues are. Anyone who lives in the Pulaski School District is eligible to vote for the school board seat. Election day is April 2nd. In Pulaski, Peri Apostolakos, NBC 26.